small sigh here. I'm going to be making an intarsia fish. So I picked out this pattern. It's actually a stained glass pattern that I found online and it's a free pattern. All right, I'm just gonna start cutting pieces out. So I cut the pieces out using multiple copies of the pattern and then glued them to the corresponding color of wood. I ran out of repositionable glue, so I'm using a washable glue, which sticks uh, way too well. I used Purple Heart, Movingui, which is yellow, and Paduk. Anyway, then I began to cut the pieces out. Here's a close-up shot of cutting away with a scroll saw. And here's some music for you. I cut out the Movingui, the Purple Heart, which is the densest wood of the bunch, and the Baduk. Wow, it's storming out there. Wow. I'm glad to be inside. Woo! Then I found some maple for the eye. Now the papers can be removed. The paper that is left sticking to the pieces will be removed when sanding. I just need to find more repositionable glue so that won't happen. There, yay! I love those colors. There's a break in the rain and it's a beautiful day. So I just brought my sander outside and it's supposed to start raining again tomorrow and then rain for nine days. Ah. So I'm gonna try to get as much as I can get done today. I nicked my thumb on that. Darn. All right, well, let's take a look at this. Yeah, I like that. I made a makeshift band-aid and kept sanding. I love this rough shaping part because it really brings the project to life. Then I rolled up my 100 grit to continue the final shaping. Okay, fingers better. I am going to roll up my 150 grit and sand away. Now this part is actual sanding. And then I go over it once more with 220 grit. I just have to figure out what I'm gonna do with the eye. Okay, I have an idea about the eye. I have this rock and it fits just right on there, but that means I need to cut out the white part from my piece. And I don't know if I'll be able to do that or not, but I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it. See if that works. Yeah, look at that. Yay. That's gonna be pretty good. Maybe. 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 
I'm thinking so. Yay. Okay, there he is. All done sanding. Then I tack glued each piece with dap glue. I then traced it onto the backer board. And cut it out on the scroll saw and sanded the edges. I checked the fit. Yes. Yay, that'll work. And then I glued the whole thing as one piece to the backer. I used a little air from the can and wiped it all with a little tack cloth. Then sprayed on some finish. I'm doing this in between rain showers. I added a hanger on the back with some little screws. These little screws are awesome! Then I added my signature and a verse. So the verse I picked is Matthew 419 from the New American Standard Bible. And it says, And he said to them, Follow me, and I will make you fishers of men. Woo! All right, well, there's the intarsia fish. And I made a tutorial on doing intarsia. And this is the project I did that with. It's a series of seven little short videos, maybe, <laughs> about doing the intarsia. So if you want to see how I did this in more detail, then you can watch the intarsia instruction series. So thanks for joining me, everybody. And maybe you'll, I'll see you there. Bye!